Well, uh, often, very often, we're talking about the movies, and uh, well, the movies are being made right here in this great state of Michigan. So says my next guest. Here's his title, actor, filmmaker, music producer from Michigan. There's an event Friday night we want to talk about. Peter Litvin, good morning to you. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing fine. Anything I missed in that uh, actor, filmmaker, music producer from Michigan, you know, like dog lover or, uh, you know, a hard worker anymore? Uh, yeah, hard worker. Dogs I actually don't particularly like, and everybody hates me for it, but, you know, that's just the way I am. But, uh, no, I think you covered all the bases. I mean, in music, I do a lot of different things, a lot of editing, engineering, producing, singer-songwriter, and so on. But uh, I think you got it all. Great. Well, we want to talk about you and, and filmmaking and uh, an event this Friday night at UICA is the ultimate angle. But first of all, Peter, where are you? Uh, where do you live in Michigan? Uh, Macomb Township at 25 Romeo Plank. They call it uh, across the state, and yet we're all in this together. When did you start uh, getting the film bug bite bit? I think about uh, seven or eight years ago, maybe a bit more. I had moved to New York, and a good friend of mine that I went to high school with named Greg DeLiso, who's also from the area, still lives here. He had uh, moved to Bay Ridge, Brooklyn, and I moved out there to work in music, and we lived in the same neighborhood. Eventually, we were roommates, and he's a filmmaker, the director, co-creator of Hectic Knife, and, you know, we were just making all kinds of short films, and he was making music videos for me, and uh, that's kind of how the whole thing got started. That's great. Well, And, again. of course, I've liked uh, movies my entire life. I'm a huge, huge movie fan, independent yeah. film fan, and... So it kind of stemmed from that. Yeah. They say, uh, well, they say you got to watch movies to, to make movies, and uh, you're a testament of that. Hectic Knife, which is to be distributed, I understand, by a, a pretty cool film company and is to be watched this Friday night. So what's it about? Uh, you know, Hectic Knife is essentially a weirdo comedy, is what, what it's getting called. And it's about a vigilante who doesn't like his life as a vigilante anymore. And he kind of just wanders around and accidentally tries to save the world because he has to. And, um, and that's the gist of it. There's a lot of stupidity. There's a lot of blood. There's a lot of bagels. And it's uh, got a lot of New York stuff because some of it was shot in New York. And it's got some Detroit stuff. And, uh, yeah, that's the basic idea. Awesome. What brings you to uh, to Ferris State's UICA? Uh, you know, it's a good question. Um, a thing called the Found Footage Festival um, is it had the screen there in the past. I know when they tour, they always hit that place. And uh, we had talked to them because Greg DeLiso, the director, is good friends with them. And he spoke with them and said, what's a good place in Grand Rapids? And they said, this place is the best. Check it out. So I got in touch with uh, people who you, you talk to over there and uh, set up a screening. And they've been very cool. In fact, I asked uh, the guy who's the projectionist, his name's Nick. I said, do you guys, do you know anybody who I could hire to do some promotion in the area? Because I really don't know anybody in Grand Rapids. And he put me in, in touch with some really, really cool filmmakers, people in the area who we hired to help promote the movie. And I met them already last week and when I was out there and very cool. So we're excited about it. Yes, talking about filmmaking, Peter Litvin, actor, filmmaker, music producer, right here from the state of Michigan, starring in and producing a film uh, called Hectic Knife. What's your role in the film? I play the main character, Hectic Knife himself. Believe it or not, as stupid as it sounds, and uh, we make fun of that throughout the movie, that is the main character's name, is Hectic Knife. So it's, you know, he jokes online that it's a biopic about him. But, uh, yeah, I, I do play some other characters, but my main function in the movie is the lead character. And then I did all the, the score, or most of the score, a lot of the sound effects, and the, the mix as well. Wow. Um, so do we call this a, a feature film? I mean, are you able to make films uh, here in Michigan? Yeah, yeah, you definitely can. It's definitely considered a feature-length film, which is, I mean, I'm kind of an idiot when it comes to filmmaking. And when I talk to people and they say, well, you're a filmmaker, or you're a producer, or whatever, I always say, well, I'm a fake filmmaker, so there's a lot of gaps in my knowledge uh, when it comes to that. But definitely it's, it's feature-length, and you absolutely can make movies in Michigan. That's great. Peter, uh, do you have a target audience for this genre? Yeah, I mean, they have to be... Uh 
I guess I don't know what the laws are. I don't know if you're, you guys probably are aware of it, but to get, to get your movie rated is really an expensive process. And because of the way the movie system works and the, the kind of uh, difficulties you can have getting your movie to play in a theater, it's not all that important to actually get it rated. But if it were rated, it would definitely be R-rated. So using that logic, it should technically be 17 and up. But uh, I, I'd like to think that when I was around 15 or 16, I certainly would have loved to have gotten my hands on this movie and watched it. And um, beyond that... I can tell you conservative types typically won't like it because it's it's got a lot of profanity, it's got a lot of violence, and that's kind of, not the profanity part, but the violence part is kind of typical of uh, trauma movies. Uh, not to say that trauma movies specifically encourage violent content, but certainly like there's there's a lot of it in some of their movies, and they're they're open to using that kind of stuff in their films. So uh, to give you an example, my brother, who I love to death, and he's a great guy, very conservative, and I, I thought he wouldn't like it at all. And bizarrely, he actually liked a lot of it and told me what he liked about it. And I had also thought because of the nature of the comedy, which it's it's so stupid, it's like Greg DeLiso and I's sense of humor is revolve, revolves around idiocy and stupidity, you know, which can be found in all facets of life, we think. And so because of that, that's the nature of it, I, I thought there was a lot of artsy types who would find it to be, you know, really just stupid and not, not think highly of it. And uh, interestingly enough, it's getting a good reaction from the art crowd. You know, they're calling it like deconstructionist humor, and they're just laughing at it, which is, you know, amazing to Greg and I. Oh, that's awesome. Well, again, Friday night looks like 8 o'clock is the showing. Get there early at the UICA, our, Univer- our, our UICA Urban Institute of Contemporary Arts. How do we find out more information about Hectic Knife, Peter? Yeah, you can certainly go to hecticknife.com where you can learn about what we're doing. Uh, Greg DeLiso, the director, and I are typically going to every screening that we either set up ourselves or if we find out there's a screening, we try to be there because we want to meet people, we want to get you know see their reactions, and we want to interact with fans. So we're going to be there on Friday. Beyond that, of course, we got the social media stuff. You can uh, check us out on Twitter. Facebook, and if you really want to just watch the movie from home, Troma, the distribution company, actually has their own uh, streaming service at watch.troma.com, where you can watch Troma anytime for free with a 30-day uh, uh, trial subscription that you can cancel with no fee. Free is good. Thank you very much, Peter Litvin. Congratulations on your success representing the state of Michigan. October 28th, this Friday night, UICA, 8 p.m. Hectic knife. Thank you.